So it's the first video of 2025 and as I want to give a bit of an update of where I'm at in life in general and what goals am I setting for myself for this year. First of all, the PhD is officially over, like completely over. No more corrections, no more thesis writing, no more submissions, it's over. I got my certificate, I can use my doctor title, it's now completely official. I worked on the minor corrections for my thesis over the holiday period in Portugal, I submitted it and I got the response in like two days, which kind of made me feel bad that I waited almost three months to do those corrections, since I could have had my title and certificate much sooner, but whatever. It's done now and it marks the end of a very very long four years. I'd like to thank one of my viewers for leaving a comment on the last video encouraging me to go ahead and finish my corrections. I had been postponing them for ages, letting myself procrastinate, and this comment really helped out. He also very recently finished his PhD. Unlike me, he did his corrections right afterwards and he got the certificate very, very soon. And that encouraged me to go ahead and do mine as soon as possible. So again, many thanks and congratulations, doctor. Now, when it comes to what I want for 2025, whenever there's a new year and I set out resolutions, I always set out a big list of goals that I want to achieve for that year. And I want to do things a bit differently this time around. Rather than writing down a huge list of goals that I want to achieve, I just want to have one aspect of my life that I want to improve upon and hopefully all the other goals will follow up from that. In particular for this year, I want that aspect of my life to be focus and mindfulness. I had to read through my journal entries from the past year and a lot of my entries are just simply complaining that I just cannot focus on whatever I need to do for a long time and that I procrastinate a lot as was the case with my thesis corrections. And that makes me not excel at everything that I want to be good at. So the big idea here is whatever activity I'm currently engaged on, I want to make sure I give it my full attention and I do my best work on it. So what does this mean for the big areas of my life? Well, if I'm at the gym, I want to make sure I'm focused on my exercise, that I'm getting as many reps as I can and not stopping because I'm distracted. If I'm working on research, I want to make sure that I'm absorbing the papers that I'm reading, I'm observing whatever I'm coding, I'm performing good experiments, good presentations, good posters, good networking. I just want to make sure that my mind is there and I'm not just going through the motions. Not that I'm not saying that I'm gonna work myself until I fall over, in fact, it's the exact opposite. I want to make sure that when I'm working, I'm doing my best work so that tasks get done on time and I have more time to rest and also better quality of rest because hopefully I won't be stressing as much that I'm procrastinating. It's a bit ironic me saying this on a YouTube video, but I would like to think that these slow and calm vlogs ask gently for your attention. They don't try to steal it from you, or at least that's my intention. So yeah, I think that's it for the update. Let me know in the comments what your goals for 2025 are.
so cold. It's so, so cold.